Woke up today, waited an hour in line for ice. Then I decided to uh, look for a gym, but I didn't. I thought I'd get roasted if I went up to center camp and I was like, yo, uh, where's the gym? But I saw a pink gym and queer gym. And I was like, I'm definitely queer passing. So maybe I'll go to the queer gym. I'm here with my bike and it, the ground looks like potato chips. The whole thing is weird. Great place to fart, to be honest with you. If you're not here ripping ass. I'm gonna do this for the rest of my life. I have a feeling I will, unless I die. Well, I mean, if I die now, then I did do this for the rest of my life. That'd be crazy, imagine. And this video, how'd you find it? Yo, who gave you my lock pass? We're shut the fuck up. Anyways, I'm gonna go bicycle on my silly bike uh, uh, over there. What's there? Nothing, exactly. Oh shit, but I'm also gonna be late. For what? Nothing, I have nothing to do. That's the best part about this. There's just not anything to do. Money isn't accepted anywhere, Burning Man, so this uh, little cash registers, uh, it's, they're just being funny. But sometimes, what the fuck? What the fuck? This is where a lot of the art gets set up and a lot of it wasn't set up yet, but just being alone in the desert wasted was fun. Crazy. After just being out in the desert wasted, biking around in the hot sun, I just turned a corner and there was a bacon camp. They were cooking up bacon giving out alcohol and this is the type of thing that happens you're hungry you turn the corner fake it <laughs> if you saw the last vlog you'd know what an art car is but they're not all built the same this one's wild this octopus with flames but basically they all kind of serve the same function as they go around people look at them and they're like wow that's so sick and then they like dance around it or like spit fire around it and wherever you are you could always see the man He's there in the middle of the entire place, the man. So we rolled up to the man. It's got like a kind of beehive thing going on. Every year, the man at Burning Man is different. I mean, apparently what's special about this year was you could go inside the man. So that's what we do is we go inside and just uh, explore the honeycomb. <laughs> this is inside the man and I've just blasted the brightness on my camera here, but everyone in here is tripping out. So one of my favorite parts about Burning Man is basically taking psychedelics and cruising everywhere on bicycles with your friends. I looked like I'm a character from Destiny or G.I. Joe. And you just go around from different art piece to different art piece. And even some people's bikes are actually intense creations of art. It's just a trip and uh, you just trip out. And once you're out on the playa, you're pulled in basically every direction. Because everywhere you look, there's something compelling, something interesting, an art thing. What is that? A fucking temple? What is going on? I must go see it. Why? Because I'm tripping and I'm experiencing ego death. These old white dudes over here were doing a cringe bit. They were more interesting than the art, actually. Where else in the world will you be tripping on acid in the middle of the desert and there's a gigantic pegasus made of metal? It's stuff like that that's really my favorite part. And I know some of y'all are like, what sauce boss? Burning Man is so cringe. Hey, listen to me. You're fucking right, it's cringe. And you better believe I'm aware of it. So I'm back in my tent now. It's uh, like 8 a.m. And uh, I just went so hard all night. Still... <laughs> <laughs> it's still a disaster, uh, but what I've done is I've wiped myself down with like fucking dude wipes, my balls and ass and armpits. I, I did a good shit while it wasn't too hot in the porta potties. Uh, brushed my teeth, got my Invisalign back in, and uh, I know it's gonna get hot in my tent. It's very nice right now, but I know it's gonna get hot, so I'm just gonna head out into the main area, and I'm gonna lie down on the couches there. So I'm throwing my hat in shades and I'm gonna head out into uh, <laughs> the dusty desert. Sleep on the couch out there. We got an inflatable couch to see how it goes, but uh, uh, I mean, I might die. <laughs>